Different speed kicks. Anyways, we're going to go into the action. Let's see how this plays out. Starting it off, you know, just Jin's tools and the, the moves that he has, they're able to shut down a lot of what Eddie has. Yeah, you know, like you said earlier about uh, Eddie's relaxed stance, some of the best tools that Jin has, it just in general, can counter relaxed stance, you know, by itself, so. Yeah, not just that, he has the ability with his long-reaching forward right kick, is able to shut down so much of Eddie's stuff. You know, and also if you get too predictable with your strings, you know, Jin, one of the characters that has a parry as well that can really, really maximize damage there. But Spiro doesn't care about any of that. No, he's not having any of it. Woo! He's like, if you're not going to pick your main, you're not going to have that advantage over me. So right now it's been working out right now. Spiro Jin taking that first round. Oh, there we go. Nice counter hit off the forward four. Breaks the wall. Electric. Some decent damage, and he has nice positioning, but the spring kick able to stop that momentum, and let's see if Spiro's able to get out of there. Yeah, it's one of the smallest stages in Tekken right here. Uh, so this, I don't know who this would favor, though. I guess whoever hits the wall first, right? <laughs> yeah, definitely. Oh, big counter hit. There's that forward right kick. Can he kill? Doesn't even finish the combo. That's a pretty difficult combo to convert off of, and man, Spiro. Yeah, able to get that rage drive. He was flashing blue, able to drop the gate on him. It's looking really good for Spiro right now. A lot of forward fours coming out from, from uh, Speed Kicks here. It's a nice move, especially since, you know, Eddie's one of the characters that does struggle with sidestep, so. Nice, able to get the pickup. Is he going to get the follow-up? No, he misses the standing four afterwards. Interesting to see how that missed. Yeah, maybe did it too late or just it could be range dependent. Yeah, not sure. Might not have been deep enough. Oh, nice. Man. Oh, the evasive action into the big stomp. Nice duck there from Spiro, too. Looking super strong. Yeah, it's not looking good for Speed Kicks right now. And the whiff on the running slash kick. Yeah. Spiro J closing it out. Whip. Yeah. To his main character, Quara. Character that he's most well known for. Yep. Finally showing up here to play. Let's see if it's going to be... Maybe it's enough or it's going to be too little too late. We'll find out. Oh, nice peacekeeper there. Puts the brakes on. Unable to get it here. Nice. He should be able to get some damage out of it. Gets a big counter hit. Oh, here we go. And Speed Kicks is looking really good in this opening round. I Why mean, didn't you pick him earlier? Yeah, you see right off the bat where Speed Kicks gets all of his damage from is being aggressive. It's interesting, too, because it's like he's being aggressive, but he's also being controlling at the same time. Yes. He knows the options with Varong, so we'll see. Able to take that first round. Let's see if Speed Kicks is able to continue. Oh, nice. Able to hit him right out of relax. And again, keeping that pressure, he has him by the wall. This is, oh, he caught him right out of it. Looking good here. Oh. Wow, got clipped out of it. Man, and look at this, the speed kicks, you know, he's just maneuvering his way around Spiro's uh, offense here. Wow, he just got hit raw by the wall rising 1-3. The follow-up here, he's pushing him towards the wall. What kind of mix-up are we going to see? Nice, able to get the plasma blade. And look at that, speed kicks is up two rounds straight. I, I really don't know why he didn't pick him earlier. <laughs> it's a counter pick. <laughs> it was a counter pick, but he didn't. He didn't. I don't it, know. Yeah, it's only a counter pick if you're good with the. <laughs> That's true. All right. Again, he's keeping that pressure. There's the peacekeeper. The follow up. Try to string the needle there with the sidestep launcher, but unable to get it. Spirogen still staying alive. Yeah, so you notice here something. You can tell Speed Kicks is so much more comfortable with this character. Every time you see Spiro going to relax, he already has an answer for it every single time. Yeah, and look at that. He's looking to close it out. He has a sliver of life left. Ooh. He trade blows. Yeah, nice try there for Speed Kicks to hit him, but Spiro willing to press buttons there. Oh, yeah. He was ready for it. Oh, that's going to convert? No. Oh, unfortunate. Oh, man. He's in a weird position. He's going to have to be careful. Everyone's getting in weird positions. Yeah, I don't know how that happened, but he was able <laughs> yeah. to crush that, beat that out of that. What's he going to do here? Again, he's just stalking his prey, pushing towards the wall. Oh, interesting, he went for the big launcher there. All right, big slide there. Spiro now. Oh, and he Ooh. caught him with the backswing portion of it. Uh, it's not looking good. This is the final round. Spirogen making some adjustments here. Oh, oh. Speed Kicks, he went for a Peacekeeper there. Un unfortunate that it went right over the relaxed stance. Yeah, right over the Slippery Kicks. Interesting, probably one at the same time. Is a follow-up here, he's pushing towards the wall. Goes for the Just Beam Skyrocket, unable to get anything into the Rodeo. And Spiro playing very patient on the floor. Oh, nice, he's pushing towards him. Look at this damage he's able to accumulate. Wow, and he swings there, Spiro. Just a little bit left. 
Is it going to be enough though? Look at this. He goes for the rage drive. What kind of mix up are we going to see? Uh oh. Uh oh. oh. He has the wall. This is big. He's going to have it. And Speed Kicks takes it. <laughs> Clutch stuff. Anyways, we're going to go to our final match between these two Spiro Jean and Speed Kicks. Again, this is the bottom half of our bracket. So whoever loses this, they are eliminated from the competition. Yeah, we're, now we're back at the uh, Arctic Snowfall. Yeah, this is an infinite stage. So there are no walls. Giving both of these characters freedom to run if they need to. That's Again, one of the things too. So it actually affects uh, damage-wise both of these characters. Yeah, no walls for extra damage. I think in that situation it probably hurts uh, uh, Horong way more. Oh yeah, just because his damage potential is way higher. When, when walls do come into play. And you just see now, look. It's already been what? 35 seconds and look how much damage has been done. Oh wow, nice. Able to get the back three, the follow up here, big combo. Oh, into the spring kick. He has no fear. And look, just like that, he's close to evening it up. Oh, what a low parry there from Speed Kick. Sniffed out that slide and that's going to be the game. Oh yeah, able to get it there. And the follow up. I like what I'm seeing here from Speed Kicks. He's been in good control of the set. You know, since making that switch to Warong, he's been able to fight and battle back during key sequences. Yeah, you would think when you play your main character, you would do uh, pretty good. <laughs> yeah, both of these players looking for that opening Spirogen. Starting to backdash a bit more. Yeah, that's you can tell this, too. this stage has been, you know, before they were in the smallest stage, now they're, they're in the biggest stage, and you can see just how much slower that they're taking it. Yeah, that was a nice whiff punish as well. Here's the follow-up, what's he gonna do? Goes for the mix-up. No? Okay, good punish there from Speed Kicks. Still anybody's round. Yeah, look at that, 20 seconds left. Oh! He got the pickup. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Into the Rage Art. This it's going to do a lot of damage. All day. <laughs> Actually, you're right. <laughs> wow. Oh, just a sliver of life left. Is it going to be enough? One more hit could do it. Oh, I what can't believe he went for that. <laughs> what was that? I can't believe he went for that. He was pl playing another game. <laughs> <laughs> but man, Speed Kicks is up now. Two rounds here on set point. Is he going to be able to take it? Spirogen, you know, not being able to make these adjustments in the open stage. Yeah, he's playing very patient right now. Both players, obviously, because of the stage, can can backdash to their heart's content. Oh, it's looking really good for Speed Kicks right now. He's getting the right reads and getting the right hits. Yeah, Spiro now in rage. He's going to have to do something big here. You know, and Speed Kick's not... Oh my gosh, what a great block, oh! but a bad punish! Bad not punish enough. for both of them! Oh, I feel like he's, he's... There's not that much time left either. He's gonna have to make some type of commitment damage-wise. Yeah, I mean... Oh, yeah, that was it. It's hard to make, it, make a commitment there because you have to use your rage to make that big comeback, but at the same time...